You going out? Alright. You a lucky dog. Run off somewhere. Nobody want to pet you. Ugh. Stupid. Put down my Yeti cup. Alright guys, what's up? I'm over here to go check our trap. Uh oh, something set it off. We didn't get nothing, what the heck? How is that supposed to work? Alright, looks like I screwed up. Yeah, I screwed up. So, I don't know what happened. See the bait stick still there. I hope the bait stick... Oh yeah, it is. Okay, yeah, the bait stick's right there. So... I need to get a camera on this and watch it. But. So, the trap got set off, as you can tell. It got set off. But it did rain last night. So, I don't know if y'all can tell it rained, but it rained last night. It didn't rain real hard, but it rained. And so, I don't know how that got set off. But we'll re we will reset it tonight. There's a new bait on there. And... Hopefully we'll catch up tomorrow. So, with that being said, let's get on to the video. Alright guys, so today we're going to be making a soda can tab hook. I don't know if y'all seen them. I haven't made one yet. But I've seen them on the internet. I'm like, that's pretty cool. I'm going to make one of those and try to fish with it. That's what we're going to do today. We're going to make a fishing hook out of a soda can. I have two different soda can tabs here. I have one with like one that's full on the back. I ain't got that hole right there, it's like full. I'll try that out. Kind of like a monster can. But uh, I'll try that out. So, let's get it. Let's get to it. Alright. So, I got some 10 shears right here. I need to cut 10, and this seems to work pretty well. So, we'll try it with this one first. So, what you want to do. Got some dust on it. Did you want to cut it right here? Okay, I'm gonna put a little indent so y'all can see it. Okay. Ugh. No, you don't cut it right. Is it, does it want to focus or not? Okay, you want to cut it right there, right on that line, but not through that line yet. Not yet. Not through the line yet. So cut all the way through it, and then you want to cut it again towards the bottom. So you get a little gap right there. See it? See the little gap? That's gonna be the bend and the point of our hook. But that's not, we're not done yet. Now what do you want to do? Is you won't have, this is basically the hook shape. Here's your, gonna be your, your eye for your line right here, and your shaft, your bend, and your little point. Now we gotta cut all this middle crap out, all this crap out the middle. So, this is what we're gonna do. So you're gonna cut it out, but we ain't gonna cut all of it out. We gotta leave a little bit of room at the top for our, our hole for our line. So that's about close enough right there. See, you, you have that little space so you can drill you a hole, put your line through it. That little middle crap you need to bend or cut it away. So I'm gonna try to cut it away real quick. Alright, I'm back. So, I just bent it out the way. And now you can see it makes a hook. It doesn't have a barb, but that kind of, that thing right... Okay, y'all probably can see it right there. Sticking out the bottom. It kind of acts like a barb, I guess. But, uh, yeah, so you just drill you a hole. Real small hole right there. At the top. And, there you go. Now, off camera, I'm going to try to make one out of this. The black one. And if it works better... And then I'll uh, use this one to go fishing. But I just wanted to try it out. 
All right, so I'm done now. It really took me like a couple seconds. It really wasn't that hard. You only have to make a few cuts. Well, this one's not as pretty as that one. But, I mean, you can still do it with this one. I really don't like that one as much because it just, it don't have the whole hook shape. This one has the whole, you know, hook shape. So we're going to use this one. And we're going to go brim fishing because that's the easiest fish to catch. And I want to show you all something. So that's what we're going to go do. All right, guys, so we're at the pond. You gotta watch out though. I just saw a big old water moccasin. This time it wasn't no water snake like last time. That was a water moccasin. Look at this crap. It's all tadpole. It's black. It's literally black. See it's foaming? Look at this. It's literally black. I don't know if I can see it, but it's freaking black. All these dang tadpoles in there. Let's see if I can get y'all a good view of it. Stick my phone in there. You ready? Ugh. They're freaking off. I'm trying to try to grab a handful of them. Watch this. Oh my god, look at that. Ugh, they are slimy and nasty. Holy crap. Yeah, there's a whole bunch of tadpoles in there. Alright, let's get back to the main mission here. I'm going go on brim fishing. So we at the pond. Let's back to catch us brim. I ain't fishing right there though. You gotta get too close to the edge. I wanna get bit by no nake. So we can go over here to our honey hole. Where I catch all my fish at. So you can catch one. Alright. So our other hook that we first made. It didn't really work out. So I had to use the black one. I drilled the hole and it just broke off. So so we got some ham on there. I was gonna use worms. I don't think worms would have fit on there though. So yeah. Let's throw this in the water. See what happens. I won't be able to film it. Probably. Because... Trying to do this all with one hand, so yeah, let's throw it in the water real quick. All right, so there's our bobber in the water. Let's see if we can get us a fish. I need to throw it out a little bit further. Uh oh. I'm gonna throw it out a little bit further. All right, so it's out a little bit further, as y'all can tell. See if we can get something to bite. Hey, you should catch all my brim over here. Or for all you people up north, bluegill. Are oh, you freaking liberals? Don't know what a freaking brim is. Okay, don't take that seriously. Don't come over here. And, wait, you ain't gonna come over here and shoot me because you don't believe in guns. Ha! Got you again. Okay. I'll get back to y'all if we get something. Alright, guys. I've been fishing for about 10, 20 minutes now. I ain't got a single bite. So I decided to throw a little piece of meat in there. And a big old bluegill came up and just ate it. So I threw my bait in the same spot. Fresh bait too. I ain't eat it. So I'm about to go back home, grab the smaller hook, and see if there's a difference. See if they'll bite on the smaller hook. Or actually the real hook, my bad. It's smaller, but it's the actual it's actual a real hook. So we'll do that, but I'm 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 gonna wait just a little bit. I'm gonna give it a chance, you know. So far it's looking like a fail. Alright guys, so we're back and we got the small hook on there now. The actual hook. Where are you going, Max? Alright. So hopefully we'll catch something with a small hook. I'm sure we will. So we'll have something for you guys to watch actually. Alright, let's 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 do it. Alright, here we go. We got a couple bumps. I was able to set my phone up fast enough. Might have to throw it out a little bit further. Might have to throw it out again. Oh, there it goes. There it goes. Boom. Haha. <laughs> Got something. All right. It's a little small, but it's something. All right. Where's this hook at? Oh, yeah. Right in the little. Okay. Y'all yeah, see the fish? All right. Ugh. Wow. Okay. I'm going to have to grab this fish. Hold on a second. All right. All right, I'm gonna set y'all down for a second so I get this hook out of his mouth. All right, we got us a little fish. I told you the bait's working, it just wasn't the hook. All right, let's throw him back. Oh, oh, he got stuck to my hand. Okay, yep, he's gone. Good. All right, so the bait was working. It just was it's just the hook that was the problem. All right, so that's safe to say that the survival hook, the survival soda can tap hook, oh, things in the way, is a fail. Cause they did not bite it at all. 
even the big fish didn't even bite it. Now the little fish has bit that. So, yeah. All right, guys. So that's gonna be the end of the video. Watch out, man. All right. So that's gonna be the end of the video. Hope you enjoyed it. We actually caught something this time. We caught a little, little, little brim, but it just proves that the soda can tab does not work. Well, I mean, it probably worked for like bigger fish, but for brim, no, it did not work. So, that being said, please like and please like this video and subscribe to my channel. And if you haven't already, go subscribe to my friend's channel, which I mentioned in the last video. And if you want to try this out for yourself, go ahead and do it. Just watch this video, learn how to cut it, and make the hook. So with that being said, peace out. Everybody.